and I'm coming to you with day five of 30 inks, 30 days. It's the return of the bucket. Heck yeah. Let's go. Okay. I'm going to rustle this up and we're going to pick an ink and go from there. I feel like I was touching that thing the whole time. I don't know what it is. So this is the one that we're picking. Hopefully you can see what it is. We are going to be using Incubara Brown Pink, or Brown Gray, Brown Pink, Brown Gray. I don't think you've actually seen this one. It's in one of the swatch videos I have not tried yet. Yeah, it's in one of the swatch videos, my last swatch video that I haven't uploaded yet. So here's what it looks like on the Tomoe River paper. We'll see it once it's wet as well, but we're going to use that. And I think I'm going to use it in a Twisby Fine. Uh, yeah, I'm going to use it in a Twisby Fine. I don't know why every time I start recording I like have a sneezing fit. So, um, yeah, so we're going to still be continuing with these um, pale inks, I guess, because this is a pretty light one. Um, do I have a swatch card for it? Let me look. There's also this uh, swatch card I did for Sailor Fuji. I was trying to see if I had Sailor um, Tsune Bari, or Tsune Biori, but I can't find that swatch card. I can't find that swatch card, but I think it's, it kind of reminds me, it's not as, it, I think it's a little more pinky rose than this, but there we go. That's going to be our ink for today. I need to fill my pen. So we'll go ahead and do that. This is a Twisby pastel pink with the fine nib. I bet the chromatography on this ink is going to be really interesting. Okay, so let's take a look at our dried swatch. It's definitely more of a halo um, in the darker bits than like dual shady on this paper, but you can definitely see the extra colors on this. I don't get it so much in the writing. There's a little bit, perhaps, but it just looks like really interesting shading. So, I need to find my clip so I can clip these again. Aha, here it is. This is an Ollie clip. I got it off Etsy. It's just a magnetic clip, and I like. When I use the weeks as a planner, I like having the month and the, um, the month and the week I'm on clipped together so it's easy to flip through. So, let's take a look at our calendar page. Zoom in a little bit. Almost looks more like pencil lead in this fine nib. Definitely a little more brown than like a gray, gray graphite pencil lead, but.
It's interesting to me how pink it looks on the swatch card because on the in that swatch it does not look uh, pink at all. Let's go ahead and do our chromatography. Apologies if I seem pretty low energy. I, I have a headache. That's a pretty chromatography. We'll let that dry. We'll let that do its thing. This is going to be a quick 30 inks today. Uh, mostly because I'm not feeling great. Oh, wait, no. Swat. Uh, splat. 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 I almost skipped the splat, y'all. That's how out of it I am. interesting to me. I'm going to do, oops. I just want to see what that kind of looks like. And we'll also do, where's my sample? Where's my sample? There it is. We'll also do a splat. Did I clean the syringe out? I'm going to double check the syringe before I... Okay, it's okay. I just wanted to make sure. Just want to make sure before I... There you go. That's interesting. That probably won't be dry anywhere near close to by the time we're being we're up by the time we're done. But that's okay. Oops. I'm going the wrong way, that's why. Interesting ink. Definitely looks more gray on camera, at least in that swatch right there.
another very pale ink swabby swabby definitely lives up to its brown gray sort of name in person um like the ow and brown i can kind of see some of the blue that we saw in um in the chromatography here But yeah, very interesting, very interesting ink. And like, this is what the swatch card looks like. Oops, you can't see that. Although on camera, the swatch card definitely looks more brown, but it looks more pink in person. So weird. I love weird inks like this. So yeah, here's today's combination. This is an interesting week so far. <laughs> anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know what you're using today. I can't wait to see what this dried swatch looks like. Um, here's our, there's too much ink on here, but um, here's our Marmon Namasane swatch. This ink swab is gonna take forever to dry. But it looks more brown. It looks more brown on this paper. And you see a little bit more of the pink in the swatch in the splats. And then it just looks more gray here. Definitely a weird ink. Seems to look different depending on the paper. So yeah. Interesting. Interesting. I can't wait till this swatch video goes up. Um, I have to work on that. But yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry if I was a little low energy. I'm just not feeling that great today. So, um, yeah, I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you again tomorrow with day six of 30 and 30 days. Take care. Love you all.